October 26, Saturday of the 29th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke Some people told Jesus about the Galileans whose blood Pilate had mingled with the blood of their sacrifices. He said to them in reply, Do you think that because these Galileans suffered in this way, they were greater sinners than all other Galileans? By no means, but I tell you, if you do not repent, you will all perish as they did. Or those 18 people who were killed when the Tower of Siloam fell on them, do you think they were more guilty than everyone else who live in Jerusalem? By no means, but I tell you, if you do not repent, you will all perish as they did. And he told them this parable. There once was a person who had a fig tree planted in his orchard, and when he came in search of fruit on it, but found none, he said to the gardener, For three years now I have come in search of fruit on this fig tree, but have found none. So cut it down. Why should it exhaust the soil? He said to him in reply, Sir, leave it for this year also, and I shall cultivate a ground around it and fertilize it. It may bear fruit in the future. If not, you can cut it down. The Gospel of the Lord Cut it down. Whenever we hear the voice of the Lord, God wants to change something in us for the better. His message must sink into our minds and hearts. We should open our hearts and allow God to change us. We are God's images, but we have to admit we are imperfect. On the way to perfection, we can be perfected only when we undertake the process of continued conversion. When people encounter us, they must see Jesus in us, in our words, in our deeds, and in our attitudes. If so, we are bearing fruits like the fig tree in the gospel.